How's it going everyone? So today I'm going to talk about what will happen if you eat nothing for seven days. So what if you eat nothing for a week? No burgers, no pizza, no chicken, steak, or cereal, nothing. How will your body respond? Will you die? Will you survive? Will you end up in the hospital? What will happen? Now in this video, we're going to go over everything right now. But before we do, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Um, that really helps me out, so I appreciate that. So how will your body respond if you eat nothing? Let's go over it right now. So for the first six hours, nothing's going to happen to your body at all. Everything's going to be fine. It's going to be normal, just like it would be any other time. So um, yeah, you just sit back, relax. So what happens after the six hours? Well, after the six hours, your body is going to start to break down glycogen, which is stored in the form of glucose. Um, now, what what does all this mean? Well, what's going to happen is you're going to start getting really cranky and hungry. That's what's going to happen. After another six hours, and your body is going to be going through ketosis, you guys. So look at that ketosis graveyard picture. That's sweet. Okay. So you will be starving yourself a little bit, which is completely fine. I do ketosis all the time. It's not that bad. Going 12 hours without eating isn't that bad in my opinion. I go around 18 to 24 hours when I fast, so eating 12 hours isn't that bad. In order to survive though, your body is going to have to break down the fat to use it as energy. So your fat is broken into fatty acids, but your brain can't use these acids as fuel. That is why your brain turns to ketone bodies for the energy. This will only work for a little bit, you guys. So that's the basic of ketosis, you guys. So. That's what happens in the first day, two, three days. Your body's going to try to break down these ketones and it's going to try to use them as energy. So after four days with no food, um, your brain, your body, it starts to break down the protein. Now, protein is going to release amino acids, which can be converted into the glucose that your brain finally needs, you guys. So finally, we can break the protein down. So your body, though, is going to start to go catabolic and it's going to start destroying your muscle mass because we are, again, breaking down these protein, releasing these amino acids. We don't want to do that, but that's the only way our body is going to survive. Your sex drive is going to go down a lot. Trust me on this. It will go down a ton. After a week, your body is going to suffer because you're not giving it the protein, carbs, fats, and the immune system that it's going to need. So every day after a week, it's going to be very frightening. You are at a higher risk of a heart attack. How long you live is now all dependent on how much water you have at your disposal. But here's the thing. After a certain period of time, around two to three weeks, you will eventually die. It doesn't matter how much water you take. After about two to three weeks, you're going to die. Now, of course, there's a lot of other people that have went longer, but around two to three weeks, you're going to be dead, in my opinion. And um, that's what most people recommend as well. Two to three weeks, you're going to be done. Uh, so make sure you guys do eat. I would not recommend a week fast. I recommend around 18 to 24 hours, in my opinion. I personally like to do 16, 18, 24 hours. So that's basically the end of the video, you guys. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Again, please subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already. Please share the video. Like it. Also, if you're interested in online personal training, there is uh, my email in the description box. Send me a quick email. We can go over pricing. Again, I'm very cheap for pricing. Very reasonable. End of video. Thank you.